please don't mistake my confidence for arrogance. I am so confident because I do everything that I need to keep myself at the top of the food chain. Mike Rashid putting down Taylor on the deck. Training, my body and my mind. Rest, recovery, and fueling my engine with only the best. A little bit more of the overtraining program, the total body overtraining program. Sean, you know what we're doing today? Oh yeah. We're doing chest and back. Chest is the primary, back is the secondary. I'm not giving y'all the whole thing, okay? Support your boy and go and download the program, okay? But we are gonna give y'all a good taste of it. What we're gonna start out on is bench press and we're gonna superset that with back. Uh, pull, uh, pull ups. Pull ups. Yeah. Okay, so what you wanna do, well, you have, you'll see the rep schemes in the, uh, on the program. It has 20 for your very first set, but I put a high number just so you can really try to warm up. It don't have to be 20, it can be 10 if that's what you, all you need. But to me, it's very, very important to warm up properly. I put 20 reps, so we'll do that. In between each set of bench press, we will superset with max rep pull-ups. So as many pull-ups as you can do, all right? Let's fucking do it. Now we're on the fourth set. Um, you missed my third set because we shot it vertical for IGTV. The reps uh, ranges goes as follows so far. 20, 15, 10, my last set was 10. So now I'm up when we start getting a little bit higher. We'll bring the volume down just a little bit. So I'm going from 10 to five right now. So 
but the pump is crazy, it's real. Me and Sean got massive pumps, stupid pumps, and we're gonna keep that shit going, all right? We're going into our strength phase now. Let's get it. One thing you guys gotta know, overtraining is not just for beginners or just for advanced lifters or somewhere in between. This shit is for everyone. I would consider myself an advanced lifter. I've been training for over a decade and I have numerous different training certifications. But the intensity of the program, the way that Mike has constructed it, it will work for anyone. If you follow me on Instagram or you've been watching the workouts, I've been getting stronger week over week by implementing these overtraining principles. You guys need to check this program out. You need to incorporate it, no matter what your experience level is. If you're a beginner, you'll be lucky to start training like this now. You're gonna make the fastest gains possible. If you're intermediate or advanced, you've probably hit plateaus where you're not getting stronger anymore. You're not gaining more muscle. Those things can be overcome with overtraining. Get the program, you won't regret it.
check it out, y'all. We got one more set to go. This is only the first progression of your chest and back uh, portion of the program, of the complete overtraining program. Listen, y'all, I'm gonna tell y'all something. I am, I was, and still am a hard gainer. You might look at me and think that, yo, Mike is swole, but you gotta understand, I've been consistently, consistently training over the majority of my life since I was 12, 13, 14 years old. And I can't think of a time that I wasn't training my entire life. So it took me a lot of fucking work. Three sets of 10 each workout wasn't gonna get me to where I am. Not just physique, but also performance. Cause that's important to me. I don't wanna just look the part. I wanna be able to be the strongest dude in the gym or one of the strongest dudes in the gym and not have to be the biggest. That's always been a cool little goal of mine. But anyway, get the program. This is what I've been doing all my life. You know, it came from just trying to figure shit out. It used to be different and it's shaped into what really works, okay? This program works. So many people have tried it already with amazing results. I got one of my closest friends, Sean Torbati, he knows his shit. He's been training way over 10 years. When he started adjusting his training to this style, he's loving it. Like, it's a mental addiction to this shit too. When you feel your, when you see your numbers going up and you feel that strength coming and it's a certain euphoria you have when you tapping into certain types of heavy weights with more reps than, is, than, is, than is expected. You know what I'm saying? You can handle it and you building up that work ethic and that work capacity. So it's hard to do, especially in the beginning, but keep sticking with it. You will adapt to it because that's what the body do. We adapt. All right. So anyway, we've done probably about 70 pull-ups or so, so far. God knows how many reps, over hundred reps uh, on the bench. We got one more to go and three more progressions. There's three more progressions to this workout, all right? But I'm not gonna do it all on, on tape. So I want y'all to support your boy and download the uh, program, all right? Overtraining.com to get the whole thing. It's not just chest and back, it's everything, every body part, all right? Let's get it, last step.